Let me go or I will kill you. <laughs> Sorry. Kill me? Wait a minute. You attacked a drunk, unarmed person, opponent, and he left you skewered like a stuck pig. You're already half dead. Just accept your circumstance, would you? Listen to me. Before you woke up, you spoke the names of some men. Remember? One was Toru Magamore. He was lying dead on the street where I found you. Remember that? He's dead then? Toru Magor is dead? Mm-hmm. Dead and gone. Let me go. <laughs> nope. Nope, absolutely not. Why? Why would I spare your life? <sighs> you know, you're a stupid girl with pitiful skills. <laughs> you're full of wrath. You're empty of discipline. <laughs> you know, you're beyond saving. In fact, the destiny of such as you is just to leave a trail of suffering and leave a trail of ruin in your, in your past and in your wake. And then, well, you know, you die young. You die alone. <laughs> just kill me already, okay? <laughs> no, more, no more talking, you know, no more talking like this. So let me ask you, one more time, Why? Why would I spare your life? I deserve justice. <laughs> justice? Give me a break. You would set the whole world on fire just to, to see seven men burn. What are you talking about? Six. There are only six now. You rescued me only to be my executioner? I had to know for certain. I can't be responsible for what you might become. You know, a warrior makes the ultimate choice to take a life or to spare a life. Don't you see? The fate of the world is set on the edge of the knife. Don't you get it? This isn't my destiny.